Hi guys, greetings of the day, myself Vijay Tavadar and in this video lecture session I am going to show you a solution on projection of plane surfaces. An example problem is like this. A regular pentagonal lamina of 25 mm side is resting on one of its sides on HP while the corner opposite to this side is touches VP. If the lamina makes an angle with 60 degree with HP, draw the projections of the lamina. Now according to the given conditions, uh, so one can draw the a solution so go to a line command with a thickness of 0 0.13 millimeter one can draw an xy line and after drawing an xy line uh, make use of a text command and name the end point of a line as x and y and then above xy line vp and hp is going to be projected sorry drawn so that it completes the first angle projections then a pentagon has to be created uh, for size 25 millimeter and it is resting on one of its sides on hp so now go to applications and macros run macro uh, once again applications macros run macro and select inside polygon the inside polygon is available in windows c drive program files solid hv19 custom inside polygon well and in which we have inside polygon just open inside polygon select the flat length and set it for 25 millimeter and uh, the number of sides in a pentagon is 5 and apply a relationship uh, press the left click anywhere on the screen so one will get the pentagon and this pentagon who is having a thickness of 0 0.5 millimeter and place it anywhere is which is required then show that the size of the pentagon is 25 millimeter Make use of a line command with thickness of 0 0.13. One can draw the corners to project on the XY line to project the front view. Now, after drawing these uh, projectors to draw the front view, I change the line thickness to 0 0.5 millimeter and then uh, draw the front view properly. And then make use of the text command and name the corners uh, like this. A and this is going to be named as B, this is going to be named as C, D and then this is going to be E. Accordingly in the front view this is going to be named as A dash B dash and then C dash E dash and finally we will be having D dash. Now the front view has been completed in all aspects. Then the lamina makes an angle of 60 degree with HP because it is in uh, parallel to HP. Select the front view, then make use of a command called as move. Move in such a way that B dash A dash as a reference point, it should be positioned on the XY line. Then go for a command called as a rotate. Rotate in such a way that B and A is on the XY line and D is going to be rotated at an angle of 60 degree. And enter the angle as 60, press the left click. Then make use of angle between command show that the angle between these two lines are supposed to be 60 degree. And after which make use of a line command with thickness of 0 0.131 can draw the projectors to complete the top view. Now D is connected to D dash and then C and E is going to be connected to the respective corners. And after C and E is connected, connect B and A. And after completing B and A, one can go for a text command and name the respective corners once again. And this will be named as A, B, C, and this is going to be D, and this is going to be E according to the figure which is going to be obtained. And then make use of a line command with thickness of 0 0.5 millimeter. One can connect A to B, B to C, C to D, D to E and back to A. So this completes the required front view in the second stage. Now what is the last condition? The corner opposite to this side touches VP. What is the corner opposite to the resting side? AB is the resting side. The corner D touches VP. Now one can select the front view completely or top view completely. Then make use of move command. Move in such a way that corner D is going to be the reference point and it has to touch the VP then make use of a command called as rotate rotate in such a way that 
D is going to be on the XY line and the opposite side is going to be selected and it has to be rotated at an angle of 90 degree and then the corner D has to be brought below the XY line because it is representing the top view. Then make use of a corner, uh, line command with respect to 0.13 mm as a thickness. Connect the right extreme, start with the right extreme corner to draw the projectors. So C and E will be projected and accordingly AB will be drawn till the XY line and then the corner D will be projected to a height of D dash. And then make use of uh, the line command with the thickness of 0.5 millimeter one can join uh, a dash to b dash b dash to c dash c dash to d dash d dash to e dash back to a dash then make use of a text command show that this corner is going to be a dash and this corner is going to be b dash and accordingly this corner is going to be c dash and this is d dash and this is a dash now one can see that the problem is completed in all aspects as per the given conditions of the questions if you are having any doubts please feel free to contact me and also please do subscribe to my youtube channel and also ask all your first year engineering students to watch this video and thanks for watching this video